Welcome to the Southside 4 Pump Station and Hydro Pneumatic Tank WebEx Community Construction Meeting. Due to proposed development in the Southside 4 service area, it is necessary to install a pump station and hydro pneumatic tank to provide increased capacity and delivery reliability to our future customers. This capital improvement project is in Council District 8. Subi Abbey is your project manager and Nathan Gray is your inspector. If you can see the screen, we will please hold your questions and post them in chat and we will address those chat questions after the meeting. If you're a call-in user, we will address your questions after we field the, the chat questions. So I am going to turn this over to Suzy Abbey. Okay, we'll run through the agenda to start. Um, we're gonna go over some introductions, give a project overview, uh, show you the project area and go through frequently asked questions. So your project team includes myself. My name is Susie Abbey. I'm the project manager with the city. Um, if you need to reach me, you can call me on my phone number, 817-392-8209, or you can email me at suzanne.abbey at fortworthtexas.gov. Your inspector is Nathan Gray, and you can reach him at 817-392-8209. 4961. And you can reach him also by email at nathan.gray at fortworthtexas.gov. Uh, our engineering design consultant on the project is Frieza Nichols, and the project manager is Olivia Kurz. And Tyler Derryberry is the um, is our partner with the consultant out at the project site. And then our contractor is Graycon Construction. Greg Graves and Corey Graves are the project managers, and Kirk Newman is the superintendent. Project area is bound by McPherson Boulevard to the north, Chisholm Trail Parkway to the east, Stewart Phelps Road to the south, and Brewer Boulevard to the west. Uh, June W. Davis Elementary School is located at the intersection of McPherson Boulevard and Brewer Boulevard north of the site here where we are showing it. Construction of the pump station and the tank is going to take place on the city owned site just south of the Sun Country Elevated Storage Tank uh, near the intersection of Stuart Phelps Road and Stuart Phelps Road. So, why are we doing this project? Due to proposed development in the South Side Force Service Area, it's necessary to install a pump station and hydro pneumatic tank to boost water pressure and ensure reliable delivery to current and future customers. The contract includes a new 8 million gallon per day booster pump station, 30,000 gallon hydro pneumatic tank, a 350 kilowatt generator, an antenna tower, flow meter vault, check valve vault, and other side work. So, what is the purpose of a pump station? A water pump station transports water by a piped water distribution system, which in this case is the City of Fort Worth water system. Pumps are used used to move water from a starting point, in this case, the Sun Country Elevated Storage Tank, which is on the same site, to your home or business by service lines with enough pressure behind it to overcome any resistance. When development is occurring in an area, the water pump station is used to increase water pressure where it is required. So how does this tank work? Um, Hydrodramatic tanks contain pressurized air and water and the compressed air acts as a cushion that exerts or observes pressure. The goal is to deliver water within a selected pressure range in the south side four plane. In this case, it would be the area in the blue area inside this circle. Um, the hydropneumatic tank also minimizes pressure surges and it provides an efficient water supply to quickly meet the system's demand. How do the tank and pump station work together? Pump station moves water from the Sun Country Elevated Storage Tank to the South Side Force Service Area. The pump station and tank work together to maintain a consistent pressure range in the system. Too much pressure can increase the likelihood of damage and lead to leaks in piping. How will this impact the school and surrounding homes? Construction traffic should impact the June W. 
Davis Elementary School and new home development north of the tank and pump station site. Fort Worth Water has notified the school administration and those along the route can expect construction traffic between the hours of 7 a.m. and 6 p.m. Monday through Friday. And if requested by the contractor, 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. or 5 p.m. on Saturdays. The contractor will work with the school to minimize traffic issues. So timeline, uh, due to ongoing and proposed development in the South Side 4 area, it was crucial that construction start earlier than anticipated in order to provide for future water customers. So construction activities at the site began on November 1st. The pump station is expected to be operational during the summer of 2021, and we expect to be completed with construction in the fall of 2020. So where can you get more information? Uh, progress will be updated on the City of Fort Worth website as, at this link. And you can also go to www.fortworthtexas.gov and enter the project number 103116 in the search bar on the home page. The link to the meeting video, the project map, and the project summary and frequently asked questions will be linked to this project page. And again, your contacts are me, project manager, Susie Abbey, 817-392-8209, suzanne.abby at fortworthtexas.gov, and Nathan Gray, the inspector, 817-392-4961, Nathan.gray at Fort Worth, Texas. GOV. If you need to report an emergency or a non emergency, you can call 817 392 4477. You can select option one for emergencies like water main breaks, sewer backups 24 hours a day, or during the hours of 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. Monday through Friday, um, be able to. Talk to someone in the call center. You can also download the My Fort Worth app from the App Store or Google Play. You can report sewer overflows, leaks, remain breaks, missing or broken meter lids, water theft, water violations, the water service, water pressure issues, and other sewer concerns. Thank you. Okay, Susie, we do not have any questions in the chat. Does anyone have a question? You can just unmute yourself and ask it. And while you're thinking about that, if you can see the chat, I have placed the contact information in there as well as the link to the website page. Okay, one more chance to ask questions before the construction. Oh, I'm sorry, um, R. Williams, is this the reason for low water pressure now? Still a question. Uh, Susie, did you hear me? Yeah. Um, okay. that's something, Mr. Williams, that's something I could look into for you. So the, 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 the pump station is intended to boost pressure to homes in future development. So the homes that are connected now should. You can email Susie, uh, Mr. Williams. To uh, get a response for that later. Okay. Have we covered everything? Uh, Glenn, do you have any questions? Okay. Susie, do you have anything else to say? No, I don't. Thank you, Sally. This is this should be posted on the project page, which is in the chat. Um, the link to it is in the chat. It should be up there by I'm going to say Monday at the very latest. 
Thank you all for joining us.